everyone and welcome back to my journey through the killer rankings. Now before getting into the gameplay, I want to give a quick shout out to these people who commented on my previous videos. I really enjoy reading all of your comments and helping you out with any questions you have or just discussing things about Dead by Daylight. So make sure you comment below on this video to have a chance at being featured in my next video. And if you want to help support my channel, you can become a member by hitting that join button to get access to several unique perks. Now, let's get into the gameplay. Streamers are bust. It's too late now, buddy. Too late. Ooh, big white ward. That must be a purple medkit that Nea has. Although I've seen some unique white wards that make you go, what? I saw someone, multiple times by the way, someone used a white ward on a medkit that had a styptic on it, and this was before this they changed how it works. So originally, whenever you use a styptic or syringe, it consumes the medkit instantly as well. So using a white ward on a medkit with a syringe is like, what is a waste. Because you're, you're planning to insta-heal somebody and... Oh, no one spawned over here. What the frick? That was weird. We might have to play more serious here because um, these people are a little coordinated. Where'd they run off to? Probably she didn't throw it. Really thought she would. She threw that pallet, but not this one. Here are Max on the chainsaw. See, these are uh, high rank survivors. You can tell by how they're playing. They're not scared.
Got him. Who says be surprised of Ev Herc? Four percent, huh? Oh, welcome to the stream, Andy. Yep. Not doing good, that great this match because I have a four man when I'm running a build you know, for blood points. I have a speed limiter on, so. What was that? She freaking pressed on the window. We're gonna get the gates powered. Yeah, I knew you were going for that window. There's someone else here. Let's go ahead and put her in the good old basement. The thing is, they know my chainsaw is not dangerous. The one person's there. And two are around here. Okay, it's still regressing. This window is open. Someone else is here. And they waited until I pick her up. 
Lag spike. Let's see if I was there. This is still regressed. They're all healing. From what I can tell. Okay, it's only these three gens and they haven't done any, so... Play. Pro play. What? Oh. And that goes to show how just because one gen's left doesn't mean it's over. Thank you so much for the follow, um, Frenchie's San One Burger. Burger. They only had one generator left, but they failed because they were, whoops, they were all focusing on the generator in um, Strode for some reason, instead of doing progress on the other gems. Papa Sims, time to lean forward in your game, your cheer chair? Yeah, right. Those survivors were experienced. My day has been good, Andy11, if you are still here. Sorry, I did not see that. GG. I see. That would explain how they could get someone up fast. Wait, what the f- A white ward consumes my kid on use? I was right that Nea did have DS. I knew she hadn't. She was- that Nea was probably the most experienced. And I did make some dumb swings at her. The undetectable status effect is actually a buff for Wraith and other similar killers because it makes them immune to the aura reading provided by perks. In the past, Object of Obsession was really OP on Wraith because if you had it, you would always know where the Wraith is. But now, not so much.
They both spawn together on that gen. and get them off this gen. <laughs> hey, Bill. Did you just get sandbagged? the one I want to see. I really have to work on not whiffing. Oh, she's savvy hooks. Bill got up. He probably has unbreakable. And he didn't even stop to save Meg. Ooh. Ooh. They're healing each other. Nivala, stop being a try hard. Oh my gosh, I'm being too hard on these survivors. So, oh wow, I'm surprised. So what I was gonna do is go back to the hook and be like, oh, easy 4k, but I need my, um, I need my thingy. So I'll go after Bill, because I want more save the best for last for the stacks. Wow. When has that ever worked, Bill? I'll just let that Claudette Sabo hooks, you know? The hooks respawn really fast now. I gotta let these survivors live longer because I've only kicked one generator. Oh, that person might die. They're on the other side. It's two. They're healing on the other side of the map. They might save her just in time. I need Meg to save. I need her to save. So I'm not gonna chase her. She can go. Got two out of. I need like ten more gens to kick. <laughs> Poor Bill. I'll let him get away with.
Someone's over here with gold. Why didn't they tap the gen? Come on, guys. I need 10 more gen kits. Who's over here? We'll kill Claudette. Although she's going for the, uh... Never mind. I'm surprised she did not go and kill her shot. I know that's what a lot of races do. They spam their bell, so it looks like they're gonna hit or something. I'll pretend I didn't see those scratch marks because I need a nine more gems. <laughs> this is why you don't go in corners against the rain. <laughs> She just got super unlucky because it's right there, but we'll kill her. Goodbye, Nia. Okay, we can't have Bill being friendly, so I'm just kill him. That's four, I think. Is it two? Three, four. That's why I baited it, because I have add ons to make it faster. I really thought I would be able to prevent the interaction there. There's 12. I know the cloud didn't ran back this way. Yeah, I don't think so. We might have to take this one into another game because I don't want to drag this out super long just for 12 gen kits. Plus they did gens pretty fast because I was... It took me a while to find them. 
So that just goes to show, even though they did nerf co-op, if two survivors spawn in the same area, they can still get that gen done really fast. Anyways, I'm just baiting um, for the Meg to come back here. Because when Ray stands still, he's completely invisible. I don't think anyone has self-care. Oh, what a good survivor. She has her sprint burst, that's why I cancelled. I just feel bad uh, dragging out the game so much for these survivors. So we just get the rest of the gens in the next game. But did you see how fast that freaking break speed is when he's cloaked? It's crazy. Played that like the biggest. <sighs> that guy's not happy even though it's ring 17. I think that was the Mig. <laughs> 